Hey y'all, hope you're having a great day so far. Uh, today, this is almost like part two of my haul from part one. We just got back from vacation in Alberta. Uh, along the way, we hit up some malls, we hit up some shops, all that kind of stuff. And along the way, of course, I collected some things from Bath and Body Works, some from Lush, but today I wanna focus on the Bath and, Bath and Body Works. Um, this is probably part two of my Bath and Body Works haul. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's just getting a little bit addicted. Why do they have sales? Why do they have so many sales? They have such good stuff with so many sales and I just can't stop. It's like they want you to come in, they want you to buy, which I guess makes them pretty good. So today we're gonna take a look at part two of this haul um, and show you a few things that I bought. So first things first is one I just actually found on the $4.95 table for the self-care self. It, I don't know, it's like semi-annual, but it's like for the self-care table. So one day it was $5.95, the next day I walk in, it's $4.95. Anyways, this one kind of called out to me why I'm a citrus fan. So I, this is Sunwash Citrus. Um, it has sugar, lemons, mandarin, and I hope you say it right, agave nectar. I think I said it right, agave nectar. Um, this one, I love it, anything citrus. I love the smell of citrus, whether it's lemon, whether it's uh, oranges, anything like that. Why? Because it just represents clean to me. So I had to get, I, this was kind of like, there was two left um, on the 590, 4.95, I think this was the 4.95 one. Um, and there was one, there was two. So I just grabbed one and I said, I'm gonna give this a try and love the scent. So I can't wait to try this out in the shower. Now, this one was in another store after I talked to, if you looked at my previous video, you know I talked to a few of the employees that were working at Bath and Body Works um, during our vacation, and one of the guys actually said, if you see um, Waikiki um, anywhere, um, make sure that you get it, because we had they hadn't been able to keep you in the stores, it was very popular, I hadn't even really learned about it, and I really liked all those island scents, um, especially Bali, Bali was like my number one. Um, so. At one of the stores, I was able to find three body creams of the Waikiki body uh, body creams. Uh, bought them up and kicked myself because I didn't buy it after because it, it smells phenomenal. But was in a store actually t yesterday and took a look at their 495 table and was able to find one of the fine fragrance mists. Now, this one, I mean, I'm not so much about spraying it on me. I have some different body sprays. Most of the time I use Lush ones. Uh, but this one, I'm gonna keep in my room because the smell of this one, um, I, I just love it. I love it. It just smells so good. Um, it's, I don't even have, I don't have the product. I, they don't put the descriptions on here. Yeah, they don't put anything on there that says it. All I know is it just smells like the beach. It smells really good. Um, I actually just, there, that's for a sniff. Oh, it's so good. Anything that can remind me of Florida. Um, I know, Waikiki, an island, I get it, But this, Florida's my second home. So anything that can kind of remind me of Florida, I'm gonna grab, and this one definitely reminds me of Florida. Now, along with the island scent as well, uh, I did find one of the other popular ones, I guess, that were quite popular throughout the season, um, Bora Bora. Uh, my niece, actually, I bought it, this one, a little while ago. My niece wanted the body cream because she only got the lotion, so like a good uncle, I gave her my original one that I bought, but I did find another one to replace it. Um, this one is the Bora Bora Ultra Sheet Body Cream. Um, this one is the, what does it say? It says sugar, lemon, dewy water, fruit, and vanilla bean. I really enjoy this one. I know this one was super popular and a lot of people bought this one up from what I heard and what I noticed around here, but it, maybe my top four, all right? Top four or so, it was good. It was good enough that I got another tube um, to have, but I also got uh, one of the Bora Bora shower gels. Uh, so I'm gonna have this one in the shower just to use. And it's good, I enjoy the scent. Like, I mean, and again, anything that's gonna remind me of vacations or anything like that, I'm gonna have it. And I really like this one. This one has a very, kind of has a really citrusy scent, which I like. Oh, it's the lemon, that's what it is. So I got this one, I got this one to replace the ones that I gave my niece, because why? I'm a good uncle. So over the last little while, I've been noticing that on the 75% off table or 75% off section, there's been a few of the men's collection, especially with the lotions and stuff like that. Um, so you never, because when you see it on the website, it's like 14 or so bucks, then you see it then 75% off, 
And I don't know, I'm just not sure if because of the store gets so many and then they decide to put on the 75% off, I'm not really sure. Anyways, I got another fresh water. <laughs> so if you saw my first video I did a few weeks ago, um, we found fresh water and probably bought up about four bottles because it reminds us of our one of our favorite areas at Disney's Animal Kingdom, which is Pandora. If you don't know, that's based on Avatar. And we swear that this smells like the scent that they pump into the Flights of Passage ride. Um, where you get to fly on a banshee and stuff like that. So there was another one sitting there in the store I was in. So of course for like, what, two fifty three dollars $3, I'm gonna throw that in there and I'm gonna have it. Even if I keep it, if I give it away, whatever. Now I think I'm up to five bottles of this. Um, but what I'm finding with this one is that with the men's collection, it all depends on where, it, what store you're in. Because with that one, not only do I get the fresh water, I got Noir and I also got uh, bourbon, which I had never tried before. I'm just gonna turn because the light's there. Uh, noir and bourbon. So if you've never tried Noir before, um, this one's got black cardamom, smoky vanilla, and a hint of musk. I have this in the body cream, and I really like it because supposedly when I looked on the website, they said this one was only being sold on the website. So I don't understand it completely, but I found it and I like it. I would definitely use this if I was like getting ready to go off for like men on the town or something like that. This may be not one that I would wear like after the gym um, or anything because it doesn't have that fresh scent to me, but it definitely has kind of a nice um, earthy grounding smell to it. So this one definitely would be like for if you're going out or something like that. With the bourbon, this one has white pepper, dark amber, and Kentucky oak. Now this one, uh, first sniff that I did in the store, this one, I like it. Like I'm glad, I, I'm kind of glad that I found it on the 75% off table so I can kind of try it and see what it's like. Um, I don't know if this is one that I would probably buy for, you know, $14 or, you know, if it's buy three, get two free or anything like that. Um, it's nice. It'll be one just I kind of throw in my gym bag just to have, or I throw in the truck just to have um, there and just use it as we go. Um, but it's nice. It's good. Like it would definitely be good for like after a workout or something like that. It does have kind of a fresh smell to it, um, but it's, it's okay. It's not bad. Not my favorite but I'm glad I got it for like $253. Now this is the part where things kind of got a little crazy because again, talking to the man, talking to those employees in Bath and Body Works, they're good. They're good at what they do. <laughs> so um, a few weeks ago, I was able to find the coconut pineapple um, fragrance spray, which I kind of have for my room and I can use around my house and stuff like that. Um, so one of the guys, I said like, do you have any more of these like products or anything? He said, no, we really haven't been able to keep it in. Um, it was one of his favorites that he purchased throughout the season. And he said, if you can find anything that's coconut pineapple, you probably want to pick that up. So the last location we were at, going to the 495 section, wasn't 75%, went to the 495 section and found coconut pineapple shower gel. And if you can imagine, again, smells just like coconut pineapple. What I like is it's not overly sweet. You can smell the coconut uh, and the pineapple is just kind of like there underneath. Um, yeah, one, two, three. There were three on the counter and I bought all three. Why? Because I wasn't about to give those up. Because <laughs> I like them. And the other thing was that, again, coconut pineapple. Kind of, I'm a huge fan of it. So this one was on the one side of the table and you know how they have them stacked up. So I go around to the other side of the table and find one of these, coconut pineapple body cream, which is awesome. So if you can imagine, yep, there was another one. And there was another one. And again, don't forget, this is on the 495 section. And then I went away after I bought three of them. Then I came back a little bit later because I completely forgot that I had to get um, hand sanitizers because I need some more of those. So when I was walking by, I saw a fourth one sitting there. I couldn't let it just sit there by itself. It needed to be with its family, with its brothers and sisters. So. I got a lot of coconut pineapple to use over the next little bit, but I don't care because I just tried a little while ago and it's so good. So good. I'm so glad I have this. Um, this is going in my gym bag. 
This is going in my truck. This is going somewhere in my house. And I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. This one's going into storage until I need it. Because coconut pineapple is now my absolute favorite. Next to Bali. Next to Waikiki. And some of the other ones. So that's it for this haul. <laughs> so yeah, our vacation, it was awesome. We got to go hiking, we got to go do a whole bunch of stuff. We got to be outside, which was so nice, especially during these times. Um, again, social distancing, wear masks, all that. We were very safe. The one thing I will say about Bath and Body Works, super impressed um, with how they had somebody at the front, how they had the disinfectants there, the hand sanitizers. They told you the expectations of when you go in, they had bags there for you to pick up. Um, I. The, the interaction with the employees over the past week, and I mean, I probably was in about five stores looking at stuff. And so again, these halls all came from about five stores. Um, and so it was awesome to interact with the employees there. They were super friendly, super knowledgeable. Um, I had an absolute blast um, purchasing from them, <laughs> which was probably a good thing. Uh, but I just appreciate the safety that they had in there and that they just made the experience so welcoming. Um, so, I mean, they just ex had expectations. Some stores, they wanted you, they, they asked you not to, um, open up the lotions or anything like that. Um, because contamination, stuff like that with the candles. Um, they open them up. You can smell the candles if you want to put the lid back on and then they asked you to turn it over so they know they could come and wipe those down. Uh, I just felt very safe, secure, and I really appreciate what Bath and Body Works did in order to um, have a great customer experience. So yeah, that's it for this one. Again, if you feel like you want to, subscribe below. Again, uh, my personal Instagram is Mr. Brett Young and my self-care for men Instagram is at self-care underscore for the number four and then men. Uh, but I'll link it right down here below uh, as well and you can feel free to follow along. Uh, yeah, so the next video coming up, probably the next little bit, I'm gonna be doing uh, the haul for the candles because there was that candle sale. Not gonna lie, I've never bought a Body Works, uh, Body Works bath and Body Works candle before. So I'm kind of excited to kind of show you what I found because I think I got a little bit addicted to these candles and I'm kind of excited for the ones that I purchased. So hope you have a great rest of your day. We'll see you soon and be safe.